Good afternoon, freedom-loving Americans. Good afternoon, sir. I have a question for you. Have you noticed that these self-anointed rulers, those who sit high and look low, those who have given themselves the authority to determine whose job is essential and whose job is non-essential, always seem to include their job as essential. You know what I'm In order to grasp what is being done to America, we must understand two things, a word and a phrase. The word is transformation. The phrase is never let a good crisis go to waste because it allows you to do things you couldn't ordinarily do. <laughs> Do you remember five days before Obama was inaugurated, he said, the transformation of America begins in five days. Did anyone in the media ask him, sir, exactly what does that mean? No, of course not. They did not ask him because they did not want to ask him. They did not need to ask him because they believed it with him. Transformation to communist means to destroy this country and then reassemble it in their socialist vision. If transformation is the ends, never let a good crisis go to waste is the means. They know that if they scare people, many people will hand over their freedom in, in large chunks. But the promise of protecting them from the danger at hand. Here's the problem. Once the machinery is in place, the surveillance, the tracking, the snitching on your neighbors, etc. It is never removed. When is the last time you ever heard a big brother giving back freedoms, hitting the reset button? Once those freedoms are stolen or usurped, they're gone. One of their favorite lies is, well, if it saves just one lie, it'll be worth it all. <laughs> really? Well, I'll just bet that would come as news to the family of Kate Stanley, the San Francisco woman who was murdered by an illegal alien who was deported multiple times, but always returned to the protection the sanctuary city. And I know it just makes my big old squishy heart tremble with love to think of the people who are promoting this idea of saving lives who will fight for any law that allows them to take the life of an innocent unborn child. Amen. I hate it when people piss down my leg and tell me it's raining. Preach it. Let's be very clear. I am not saying that this virus is not dangerous. No, no, it is. I am not saying there is no cause for concern. There is. I am certainly not saying that this is all a hoax and we have nothing to be concerned about. No need to be vigilant. No, no, no. That's not what I'm saying. What I am saying 
is that this is a dangerous situation, medical situation, that has been commandeered by leftist political operators for the purpose of advancing their agenda. That of radically transforming America into their socialist dystopian nightmare. I can't speak for anybody else, but I will tell you, I prefer dangerous freedom to peaceful slavery. Right. Thank you. That was very well done. Appreciate that. Almost got me in tears over here.